Hello everyone! Welcome to my channel! Welcome to my journey! Today, I will gonna show you how to make this chicken in a clay pot, bake in the oven for 3 hours. This chicken, guys, is so taste, yummy, and delicious. It's like the same flavor with the Philippine chicken adobo. You can try this at home. Stay tuned! We have here potato one whole onion and carrots cut into long thin slices we have here our chicken and this is one whole chicken I cut it into four pieces and also I clean it very well and remove the excess skin Actually guys, every time I cook chicken, I remove all the skin, you know, to, to lessen the, the fats and cholesterol in our food, so it's, it's better to remove the chicken. But remove the chicken to remove the skin, I mean, we have here our garlic, our onion, and the ginger. I put it all together guys inside the machine. Mixed together. For seasoning, we have here our salt, a cumin powder. Black pepper. We mix Arabic spices. Heinz white vinegar. A kikuman soy sauce. The extra virgin olive oil. And we have also here our two tablespoon of porcelain flour. Guys, in putting the spices, I just put it optional. How I, how I taste, I, I taste to be like how much black pepper, how much salt. And these Arabic spices, guys, if you don't have, you can use the uh, turmeric, cinnamon, and dried lime. You make it powder and cardamom. That's the mixed spices, Arabic mixed spice. So now, uh, actually I don't put uh, too much salt, just enough salt because the soya sauce is already salty. So I just put a bit of salt, a sprinkle of salt. And then guys, I already put uh, the ginger, the, the, the garlic, and the onion that I, I made it in the machine. And then I put already the flour and then the cumin. The cumin, I only put two teaspoon of cumin because you know the cumin it has a really have a strong smell so I just put a little of it and then black pepper if you want it to be spicy then you can put a lot of black pepper it depends upon you and then this Arabic spices but guys if you don't have any of this Arabic spices you can just put the turmeric and cinnamon that's it and that, that, that will be fine so just put enough of it me I, I put uh, a lot because I like the smell of this a lot of spices the, the food really smells good because of this cinnamon vinegar you know because vinegar it can lessen the smell of the chicken and also it's really tastes nice and good if it's sour a bit so I just put enough and the, the soya maybe just one fourth cup or less because you know it's not really nice for the food to be salty so just put just enough to taste and then olive oil you can put uh, a 
bit a lot of this olive oil if you have a lot and then mix it well and you can marinate it guys in one to two hours if you have enough time but if you don't have enough time you can just put it directly to the to the clay pot and uh, you know and uh, we have to bake that uh, uh, this chicken for three hours so that's fine so mixed it very well and very well so the taste will absorb inside the chicken So we we'll put it now inside the oven. Um, as you can see, guys, I put this uh, baking tray to support the clay pot because the clay pot is heavy. So now we have to bake it in three hours maximum with the uh, with the heat uh, with a temperature of 250 degrees. Now three hours is done. Our food is ready. Look at that. As you can see, guys, there's two onion because I add one more. And also, you can you can put mushroom if you want because it doesn't like mushroom, so I don't put mushroom. So look at that. The smell is really good. It's yummy, guys. You can try this at home. You can try this recipe at home. If you want uh, questions and another clarification, just just check the description box below thank you so much guys thank you for watching hope you enjoy